I know what you're probably thinking. This story is going to be about the beautiful side of life. Having a big message like, love the life you live, live the life you have. Picturing a cloudy sunrise by the ocean. Sure, sometimes life is beautiful, but this ain't that type of story, Vato. Take me for granted, what would happen for Venice? Then I heard that they panic, my shooters only speak Spanish. Where do we begin? Let's start here. Don't worry, that's not cocaine, it's just flour. I'm out here finessing people. So you're still doing this, huh? Mickey told me to be selling around the school. This is Angel. He's the only friend of mine that tries to help me out. You don't. Yes, yo. Turn on the Mexican mafia, it's gonna make life better. You thought it would be silk suits, low riders, hot chicks, all the money in the world. And you see how there's none of that, right? All you're doing is just committing horrific acts to people, which eventually is going to cause you to be dehumanized. It's too late. It's never too late. Get out now. It's all over something you don't even own. A street, a gang, a territory. You don't own it. You're killing for it. You're dying for it, Chico. Look, man, I'm just trying to help you. You have your whole life ahead of you to become something more. You don't want to waste your life over some BS. Alright, listen, I'll catch you later, alright? This is the last time I talked to Angel alive. This Vato boxer found out Angel was seeing his sister. What are you doing, bro? So he had the idea to beat him with the bat. Hey, Angel, I thought you I told you not to be around my sister. Telling me God, fool. You know what? Since you want to take the bat from me, why don't you do it yourself? So after that, this is what I'm doing now. Why you stop? Car ran out of gas, they say. That's Luna, he's helping me get through this. Though, I don't know him very well, but he's always the clutch. Ah damn, you see you trying to steal one? No, I say there's a gas tank in the trunk. I always keep one in case this happens. Do it, I say. Do it! Still thinking about unhealthy I say. Every day. Just, why did I have to be like this? Why couldn't they leave homie alone? I know, I say. They said I'm gonna get out, I say. Why didn't you close your ojos, I say? Just remember him. You know what? So you want to take the bat from me? But you do it yourself. So he had the idea to beat him with the bat. But he didn't do it. He made me do it. Do it, I say. Do it! I am God's poor excuse of a human being, said my mother. Change yep. it, yep, change it. Hey, Vato, I think I saw something over there. It's go check it out. Who'd you see? So I saw something, fool. Hey, Luna, I don't see anything. Really? You don't see anything? Nah. Is he dead? You may ask. No. But I wish I was. Didn't know you came back up, boss. They just released me from the can yesterday. And unfortunately, I got a problem. Well, uh, it must be something important if you call me up here, boss. It's one I need done soon, okay? Okay, but give me some context. Okay. I'm gonna summarize this really quick because we're running out of time. 
All right, boss, lay it on me. So basically, there's these kids. Uh, one goes by Luna, the other goes by Nisio. You've seen them before. Uh, from what I'm understanding, uh, Nisio sold all of our drugs over some personal business he had with Boxer. And I'm guessing Luna helped him out over some redemption BS, you know. And I guess they thought they would skip out of town with the money and uh, it's pretty important you retreat it back. Oh, wow. That's a story coming home too. But how am I going to find them? There's always a tracking device. Exactly. In every briefcase that I own, there's always a tracking device. Come on, you should know this. And from what it's telling me, his location is at home of Flossmore. Wow, that ain't far. I wonder why they hide out over there. Who knows? But, uh, go do it now. And while you're at it, see if you get your friend involved. Who, Quincy? <laughs> why do we need his help? Because he gets the job done. And I like him better than you. You're always goofing off, man. I don't like that. Alright, boss. I'll call him up. This is Channels Television's Breaking News. Good evening, I'm Keith Strong, and we have just received breaking news regarding the Mickey DeLuca breakout. Yesterday around 9 o'clock, Mickey DeLuca, one of the most notorious Mexican Mafia members, broke out of MCC prison. There is no sign of where DeLuca went, and authorities are asking that citizens around Chicago Heights, Tinley Park, Orland Park, Olympia Fields, and Homewood Flossmoor be aware of their surroundings because we speculate DeLuca could be nearby. I thought you said that they released you. What made you believe that? Alright boss, 